Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. After looking over my partners here, I noticed that some of them are kind of low on HP, so I think I am going to recover their HP after all. Now let's go inside the ship, which has an interior that's larger than the exterior. Uh... Oh. 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 No thanks, I'll, I'll be out here. No, actually I have nothing to fear here. I have a new, well, slightly new, a badge set up here which I'm going to be utilizing for this battle. I've got the usual charge and power bounce combos, you know, with the, the partner attacks, you know, multi-attacks and whatnot. I've also got the soft stomp to reduce defense, head rattle for disabling, same with ice smash. Uh, soft stop to lower defense, sleepy stomp also for uh, defense lowering. But here's something new I've got here. A defense plus badge because this battle is probably the most difficult battle that you're going to have at this point in time. In fact, the difficulty jump for this battle is quite high compared to other parts of the game. So I recommend uh, equipping this just in case, especially if you're under leveled like I am. <laughs> um, over here, the timing tutor badge, of course, you know, just for the visual timing for you guys. And attack FX, Y, and B badge, because when you have two of these FX badges equipped at the same time, they cycle through sound effects. I thought that would be fun. <laughs> Alright, let's go inside. And he really should dust this place. Now look at that, it's ugh, ugh. Ooh, treasure! Oh. No, I, I, I'm here, I'm... Oh, I told you he should have dusted! <laughs> there he is! Enough! I grow tired of this spooky business. I am a pirate, blast it. Pirates do not moan. I am a cold-blooded villain who robs innocence of life and loot, not a crying ghost. And you are after my treasure! Well, not really, just that star at the right side of the screen. Oh, you're not going to listen, are you? And this, this is my ship. What are you doing here? Speak! I can't speak! Mario never speaks! I'll turn your mustache into a bone polisher, amigo! <laughs> Yo! And then the battle starts. I love the music for this boss battle. Alright, let's start immediately with a tattle here. And yeah, as you can see, he's got his full body now. Not just a floating, disembodied head. So, tattle, Cortez. Let's do this. Mm, bloop, bloop. That's Cortez! He's a dreaded pirate spirit who wants island. Max HP is 20, attack is 4, and defense is 1. His HP may seem low, but he's a spirit, so even when his HP is 0, he'll come back. Plus, he has tons of different attacks. He's as tough and as scary as he looks. I'd say you just keep damaging him, and sooner or later he'll go down for good. <laughs> Let's give this torment spirit some eternal rest. Alright, starting with a charge. I'm pretty sure you know my usual boss strategy here of just uh, blitzing the enemy. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, he's got actually two attacks in this first phase, and get out of the audience! He's got that attack which does four damage automatically, and then he's got another attack which he uses, which he attacks with all four of his weapons that you gotta time uh, as he attacks. Anyway, I'm going to charge with Mario 2, I think. Sure, why not? It's just gonna wait, wait it out and see here, you know, wait for his other attacks while doing something uh, productive at the same time. Oh, yeah, you can also attack both you or your partner, so it doesn't really matter who's in front. Alright, let's start attacking here, I suppose. Um, well, I'll do a power bounce, actually. You'll notice that you can attack either the Bone Pile or Cortez. It doesn't really matter which one you attack, as they both have the same defense. I guess they just have them there so that you can do your aerial attacks and other stuff. I don't know. <laughs> It's, it's just like, there's two different ways to attack them, even though they're both, they both do the same thing, so it, attack however... Ah, man, I did a terrible job guarding that. <laughs> just attack however you feel comfortable. Uh, I'm gonna do a head rattle here, just to demonstrate this. Ah! Look at his face. <laughs> I always do something to humiliate the big bad bosses. <laughs> I love doing that. I um, guess I'll keep charging. I think this is going to be overkill, though. When I get to the next phase... Uh, ah, I'm doing a terrible job guarding his attacks, even though I'm going to utterly destroy him in this battle. 
because I've got a, a bad setup of the gods, and yeah. <laughs> and phase one is done! The curtain closes. The curtain opens and he's back with 20 more HP, and this is a really freaky snake phase right here. Anyway, I'm going to just attack him normally here and then keep charging with Goombella. I like to at least show off his, uh, uh, def uh not defense, his uh, attack. Yeah, this charge is going to be way, way overkill. <laughs> uh, oh, jeez! And you would be wise to, um, dodge it with Vivian, or... How about this? Just, you know, let's just speed things along here, actually. <laughs> you know, why risk my HP getting low from just letting him attack me? Yeah, let's just do that. <laughs> that may have been overkill, but let's let's be honest here. This, let's just be conservative at this point and use an actual good strategy. <laughs> so now, as you can see, his, uh, all of his tools, you know, all of his attacking implements are now floating disembodied tools of their own and can all attack you individually. So at this point, you're probably better off using something to attack them all at once, like an item. Not an earthquake, obviously, because they're floating and that only attacks uh, ground enemies. So how about a nice old-fashioned earth tremor to wipe them all out in one shot, since they've all got 4 HP. Um, after two turns, I think, they will respawn. So, yeah, you might want to keep your star points just to sort of defend yourself from those implements of death that he's got there, because all their little attacks stack up rather rapidly in this third phase here. So, yeah, just keep them wiped out with your star power. And how about... Yep. Let's charge up. Mmm, feeling good. Yep. I am terribly guarding his attacks. <laughs> oh, whatever. Let's just start normal jumping. And I am doing even terrible at... Wow, what, what's wrong with me? Why Why can't I time things? This is just... This, I, I'm battling a semi-tough boss. This is not the right time for them to start... I mean, this is not the right time for me to start messing up so royally. Anyway, <laughs> another Earth Tremor since they uh, came back to life. Just concentrate on those nodes. Oh, yes! It's actually good enough to wipe them out now, but I'll be going for maximum damage here, so... Yeah! Feel the pain! And... Let's finish him off with a multi-bong. This actually went a lot easier than I thought it would. <laughs> yeah, that was way, way easier than I remember this battle. <laughs> maybe because I've just mastered the game. Well, maybe not the timing of things, clearly. No, I just gotta get the hang of that again. But what I mean is I've mastered the strategy of this, this game. No, my treasure! And he's gone. <laughs> a little, little tiny head. Lots of dots. I'm done for. Oh! oh you are foolish, amigo. Oh, I'm not dead. Well, technically, I was already dead. But my spirit endures, tied to my treasure. So you cannot do anything to me. I do not live, amigo. <laughs> Still guarding this treasure for hundreds of, of years is almost as boring as death. <laughs> I could see that, for sure. What? You are not even interested in my treasure? Yep, yep. And why are you here? Hmm. Huh? You want this, amigo? Yeah, that would be nice, actually. This little rock over here? Are you serious? Yeah, well, uh, that's no big deal. Here, take it. What do I need one or two extra gems for? I not really like that one, anyway. <laughs> if only we talked it out! If only... We talked it out! <laughs> we got the Crystal Star! Woohoo! Sweet Feast is like an upgraded Sweet Treat. It plays exactly the same, actually, in that you just, uh, well, you actually can hold left rather than flicking left to shoot things. Anyway, that chapter is over! 
Cortez, Scourge of the Seas, Mario suddenly defeated this fearful spirit and claimed the Crystal Star. Perhaps the peaceful citizens of the world no longer need fear Cortez and his fellowship. The only problem remaining is how Mario will escape this isolated island. And could there be another problem still hiding beneath our hero's nose? Maybe. Maybe not. Who knows? This part's gonna be short unless I continue from here. <laughs> Well, that should do it. If you don't need anything else, away with you, amigo. <laughs> like how he calls you amigo. Month star. Day. Circle star. I wonder what those symbols even mean, anyway. Like, what numbers they are in relation to. Oh, forget it. <laughs> and then I heard something. My ears could not believe. We have already discovered the legendary treasure of the Pirate King Cortez. Mm -hmm. oh, we got pooped out the back of the ship. Alright, so here we are at this point, and we gotta make our way back to the group of peeps. What am I doing here? I need Yoshter out. Yeah, I can't make that jump normally. Not gonna save my game here. Never save my game in the middle of parts because if I need to uh, restart due to a bad recording or something like that, yeah. Uh, whoa, what was like an earthquake in there? Are you alright? Yahoo! You made Cortez? Wow, you're really something. Yes, now that you've got some free time, why'd you get us out of here? Um. Well, that shaking caused this wall here to crack a bit. I feel a breeze. See, that crack wasn't there before, so you wouldn't be able to bomb that. Now you can. We can break down this wall. I think we could escape. I guess that's not much help. What? A breeze? How are we gonna bust through that, that solid rock, though? Well, Mr. Tough Guy, I'm sure you can take care of a rock wall or two, right? I uh, hope so. <laughs> yeah, I really need to get out of this stinking place before I flip out. <laughs> oh, Frankie, if we got out of here, how would you feel about living on this island? Oh, come on, Sugar Beet. Maybe we ought to think about it after we get out of here, huh? <laughs> uh, uh, let me out. I need to get up there. There, okay, there, there, there. What do you have to say? I can feel a little base of the crack here. I can even smell the ocean. That's very promising. So let's bomb away. Get out of the way. Mm, I guess it doesn't hurt him. <laughs> ah, it worked just like I said. Uh, well, me first. <laughs> Come on, everybody. Let's get out of here. And so they do. This damn cave here is just not good for my skin. Let's go, Frankie. Look at him go. <laughs> Everyone in orderly fashion, please. Just take your time. If everything's safe now. You saved our lives, man. I'll never forget you. But I need to leave now. Me too. Let's get out of here. <laughs> oh, by the way, over here, I didn't show this earlier. I, I didn't. Yeah, look at this. Wacko! I'm Wacka! We got some good weather today, right, right? Makes me feel like nothing bad could happen on a day like today. Wackadoo! Yeah, so he's, he's having a pretty good day, so... Mm, of course, yes, he is also pretty darn nice, too. Wickedy wack wackadoo! I wanna be... Wackadoo! Wacka, we got some pretty... Yeah, he's got two different lines. So, anyway, uh, what am I doing here? <laughs> oh, wait, I want... Yeah, I want Goombella out. Uh, this is... No, 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 I want, I want Tattle. That's a rare Wacka. I don't think you see many of his kind anymore, no? Nope. If you whack a Wacka, they drop a Wacka bump. Those are supposed to be delicious. They fetch a high price in gourmet auctions, too. Yup, super precious delicacies. Still, whacking a defenseless creature to get one, you'd never do that. Right, Mario? Ah! Wacka! Oh, don't hit me! <laughs> so if you get a Wacka bump... You can recover 20 HP and 20 flower points. I should have shown this when I came to the island. I put up an annotation, though, on the video of when I came here. Yeah, this is the, the beach when we first arrived here. Uh, you know, with the ocean and whatnot, with the first star piece of this place. Uh, by shaking uh, something right there. Yeah, that's it. Uh, so, anyway, let's uh, chat it up with the peeps. I'm just glad my little dame is safe and sound. I didn't know what to do, stranded in that cave, but the whole thing was rather exciting. <laughs> wow, sure is bright today. Hey, in case I haven't said enough, thanks for saving us. You're welcome. Yep. I need to get back to Rope, my brother is waiting. Ah, I love
love this salty air. Let's move through here, and hey, it's flop. And, uh, oh, Mario, welcome back to my stalwart captain. So, have you found the treasure? How was our little expedition ferry, hmm? What? The spirit of Cor Tor or Cortez was guarding the treasure? And you beat him, but you left all the treasure there? Ah, what were you thinking? What were you trying to be nice? Oh, well, that's what I like about you, I guess. <laughs> Uh, would it be? Brother? <gasps> what are you doing here? Remember there was one on the ship that was looking for the brother? Yep. I came all the way up back. Look at you, brother. All the way to this island. I came looking, but the ghost attacked us. I don't know what I'm just saying, but I found you now. Huh? You're both saying too? So we're all stranded here as well? Hmm. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! What? Hold on, huh? What was that? Whoa, jeez! We're being shot at! But by who? Who could be doing such a thing? Ah, what is that? Ah. Pardon me, guys. Boo -hoo. I mean... Boo! 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 Oh, 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 wait a second. So sorry to surprise you. No, wait. No need for that fake politeness anymore. Good job getting the crystal star. Oh, yeah. Seriously. Good job getting it for me. Wait. Who, who are you? Reveal yourself. Oh, I know. Ain't that good old Four Eyes? Yeah, it is Four Eyes. What's he doing over there? Hey, Four Eyes. It's dangerous up there. Hmm? Hmm? What's with this lukewarm reception, huh? Dramatic entrance here. Oh, whatever. I'll spell it out for you, idiots. You may not have known. You may have known me as Four Eyes, but I'm actually. <gasps> no, it can't be. Oh, 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 oh. The great Lord Crump. Oh man, did I fool you? I never would have guessed that in a million years. I was the mastermind in the shadows, running this voyage. It hurts to be this good. <laughs> Now, Mario, enough of this. I'm on a schedule here. Hand over the crystal star, because you know what'll happen if you don't. You're gonna keep shooting at me and missing terribly? <laughs> Starboard cannons! Port cannons! Fire! 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 <laughs> hey, yikes! Oh, I was with a pirate all this time? Man, this! Well, what are we all standing around for? Cannons, people! We must flee! Look, we're, we're seriously, we're not much good for anything without a ship to sail. Hmm. Wait! I have it! I'm a genius! We have a ship at hand, and a fine one, I must say. Mario, take me to Cortez. Yes, my brain remembered what you said. <laughs> you said that Cortez had a ship. If the legend is true, then we should be unstoppable on that cursed ship. Flavio, what are you talking about? That's crazy! This is Cortez the pirate you're talking about here. Even if Mario did beat him, why would he lend you his ship, huh? He'll cream you! Cream you! <laughs> hey, I may be a coward and a cad, but I still lead you. I have a duty to protect you. <laughs> we will be cannon fodder if we sit and wag our tongues. We must at least try, Cortez. I want to hear no complaints. I am your leader, and will negotiate with this Cortez. Now, Mario, take me to this pirate scum. This instant. And thus he's joined our party once again. That stinking four eyes always thought he was right fishy. <laughs> Finally found you, brother. Well, I guess maybe. <laughs> no, I don't think you are. You, you are in no danger by his poor aim. Ah, brother. I gotta protect my tender little snack muffin. I promised the boss. Hey, help me, daddy. Oh, well, let's see if we can find some help. From Cortez, maybe he'll be a good guy if we just talk to him again and see see what he has to say over here. So let's go talk to him in the next part. I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you then. Well, I hope there's not a cave in between this part and the next part. <laughs>